Hey there, yarn lovers, it's Gary, and I'm coming to you from my living room in Vancouver, Canada. So, welcome, welcome, welcome. Today is Thursday, March the 5th, 2020, and this is video 37. I just got done uploading a video uh, which showcases some mystery yarns. So, it, it is a bit of a fun project, and it's called the hashtag 2020 Stash Flash. It was a brilliant idea from our one and only Petra from Petra's Happy Place. So thanks Petra, hi, how are you doing? For putting this all together and tagging me. It is open for anyone with a YouTube channel that deal with fiber and the love of fiber arts. So uh, yeah, uh, please put it together and get your fiber friends to guess what is in your mystery box of yarn. And what I'll do is next week, I will reveal what I put in my mystery box and review some of the great content and comments that have already started flooding that video uh, about like best guesses, what some uh, ideas were for each of the yarns. So all of that's fantastic. Thank you so much for commenting. And uh, I, I love all the people who have just uh, joined me and also the ones that have been with me for a while keep those comments coming. But this particular video that I'm showcasing today is to talk about a yarn giveaway. So as you may recall, a few videos ago, I was speaking to uh, my fiber friends about turning 50. So this month is my birthday month of March. Later on in the month is when I turned uh, 50. So it's a big uh, milestone for me. So I just want to commemorate it with a bit of a yarn giveaway to all of my fiber friends out there who have helped me along the way and open it up for any newcomers as well. So uh, as the title suggests, it's a giveaway of yarn. So let's get stuck into the giveaway. So what I'm doing is I'm uh, throwing in a comfy cotton in the colorway Mai Tai. Now this is a uh, three weight and it's great because it's a uh, cotton and uh, polyester blend. So 50% cotton, 50% polyester and great for, for summer. Uh, so it will breathe. And what else can I tell you about this? It's machine washable and dryable. And in the skein, the, the band on the skein is saying one K can give you a whole entire scarf and you get 200 grams and in that is 392 yards or 358 meters. They're suggesting to use a crochet hook of, I can't read that, maybe it's a five millimeter, I don't know, or knitting needles 4.5 millimeters. So. I'll just show you a thing that I made up using a different colorway. So it gives you a bit of an idea of what you can do. So I made up a sweater. So it comes out speckly like this. And the colorway that I used was called Driftwood. And the pattern I used, I will also link down below in the description box. Now this isn't part of the giveaway. It's just to show you what you can make with what is in the giveaway, this comfy cotton cake. And the next thing on the giveaway items is this Wool Ease from Line Brand. And this one is a four weight. And I believe it has, it has some wool in it because the name suggests Wool Ease. It's 80% acrylic and 20% wool. So for those who have, uh, I guess, animal fiber allergies, uh, perhaps maybe this one can be gifted or passed on. It's in the colorway <clears throat> Blue Marine. And this one also you can uh, machine wash and tumble dry. I have to stop it because I've got something in my throat and I need to take some water. Okay, I had to just stop the video there for a little bit of a water break. I've got some water now. Uh, carrying on with the giveaway. So this is what I have also in the giveaway. It is loops and thread, which I purchased from Michaels in the uh, collection called Waterford Big. And the colorway is Plum. It's a bulky five. You have to hand wash and lay flat to dry. This one I believe has a little bit of 
wool in it has alpaca so it's 80% acrylic and 20% alpaca it's very very squishy and just divine I love it I love it a lot so uh, what they're suggesting here is a crochet hook of seven millimeters and I believe I can't truly read this but it's six millimeter knitting needles I think and in the skein you get 243 yards or 223 meters it is uh, 250 grams in this ball uh, beautiful 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 yarn and I what I've done is I've actually uh, crocheted up because I bought two skeins I crocheted up a swatch so you, that you can see what you can do with it and uh, this was a small part that I had used in my skein and it would make a lovely scarf it would make also a really really nice shawl so uh, bulky five works up very very quickly and it's very very soft but if you have allergies to um, animal fibers it does have alpaca in it so you might want to give this forward to someone else uh, what else do I have here I have two skeins of this which is Caron simply soft and it's a lovely shiny sleek yarn and uh, let me see the colorway in this one is renegade camo now I love green and I think this would work up really really nice uh, especially lately I've been doing a lot of camo chic stuff so I think this would be a very very nice uh, yarn to to work up and use so it is a four medium weight it suggests using five millimeter uh, knitting needles or a five millimeter crochet hook you can uh, machine wash and you can tumble dry so that's really really helpful I think as well this one is all acrylic but I'll just double check double check where do you say where what you are 100% acrylic yes so that those two together could uh, work up a nice hat um, or some mittens and a scarf uh, yeah or even a uh, cowl it would be a really really nice cowl as well the next two in the giveaway are these two which I got from Mary Maxim and they were in a mystery bag and I, I had colors that were very similar to this yarn so I had overkill of this color and I I believe it's in another country the color names but it's called twisted jean art and you'll get two of those it is a hundred percent premium acrylic and you get 200 meters or 218 yards they are suggesting to use a five millimeter set of kneading needles and probably a five or six millimeter crochet hook would work as well that's the name of the color there as I said in a different language it is party rank anyway it's in a it's in a nice kind of baby uh, blue slight morning blue color so you get two of those and the final two that I've got in my uh, giveaway are from Hobium before they went on their little break <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I it's called Kartopu crystal and the neat thing about these two are that they are made up of two lace weight strands or fibers and you can choose to either hold them together mix them or uh, choose to uh, separate them and if you separate them you get 900 meters and if you hold them together you get 450 meters so it is a hundred percent acrylic you can machine wash it uh, doesn't say I don't know what P means but P in a circle I don't know what that is I'm guessing you can probably tumble dry it but maybe find out what those instructions mean before doing that and uh, yeah so I've given a brown and a kind of like a spring a spring green very fresh spring green and 
no colorway names, I just have uh, color numbers. So I've got K1369 and K1892. So a little bit about uh, that particular brand of yarn is I did buy, and this is not part of the uh, giveaway, it's just showcasing what you can do with this specific uh, yarn. So, so I got this kind of like a uh, yellow gold color and I got uh, this one here in honey and what I did was I played around with blending the two together and I came up with a swatch like this. So you can get a lot achieved through uh, just using the two skeins and playing with the strands and having uh, many or less of the strands as you want. So it starts off with lace if you hold it in uh, one strand and then if you hold it with two it's kind of like a light DK. If you hold it with four it gets more like a uh, DK3 uh, weight and hold them with uh, five it's like a worsted. So you can get a lot of variation using the uh, those two Kartopu crystal uh, skeins that I'm gifting as well. So I'll just go through them again. We have these two here. I don't know whether you counted, but we're, I'm going to do it here. So here's another two. That's four. That's six. Eight. Nine. And ten. Okay, I'm going to talk about some rules here. So I'm not affiliated with any of the companies that I've mentioned or any of the brand of the yarn. I purchased all of this yarn all on my own with my own money. Uh, YouTube has um, has no, uh, I guess, affiliation with this giveaway. So it is just myself doing the giveaway to all of my yarny friends and subscribers. So what you need to do to enter this giveaway is that you need to be subscribed. You need to like this video. It would be wonderful if you shared it with uh, other people, but that may actually impede your chances on winning. So perhaps maybe on another video, you could actually share this channel. <laughs> and um, it is open internationally. So wherever you are in the world, I will ship this box of prize yarn to you and uh, I will pay for the postage out of Canada but just for you to know that whatever costs that are incurred entering your country whether they be duties or taxes or any other financial burdens that happen to collect or receive this yarn uh, that will be at your responsibility uh, to pay for and to receive the gift. Now if your country does not accept gifts from Canada, uh, then I will have to come back and pick another winner from the comments of this video. You need to also comment in this video down below to enter yourself into the prize of the yarn. And what I'm going to do, it doesn't matter if you uh, enter multiple comments, I'm going to use what they call the random comment picker from, uh, I believe it's uh, associated somehow with YouTube, and uh, it's going to flush out any multiples of the same person uh, entering messages, and there goes hubby through, <laughs> through that doorway there. Um, so yeah, it's going to be, uh, it's going to classify multiple messages from a, an individual as one entry. So um, yeah, Make sure that you comment, make sure it's to this video, make sure that you are subscribed. I will be checking and that you give me a thumbs up. That would be awesome, awesome, awesome. So what about time? So let's look at some timing factors here. I'm going to open this competition or this gift giveaway when I post and publish this video. So we are looking at, uh, Possibly, I'm going to try and get it up tomorrow, so it'll be Friday, March 
the 6th at midday 12 uh, Pacific Standard Time and it will be open till March the 31st at 11.59 I will close it Pacific Standard Time. Give me a couple of days in April like maybe up uh, anywhere up to the 4th of April to uh, pick the winner with the using the random comment picker and announce it on uh, YouTube and then I will give the winner the chance to respond with two weeks so on the 15th of, of April 2020 I will uh, leave that open for the winner to get a hold of me now I always put in my description box my uh, email contact information so if you happen to be the lucky winner please uh, email me at the email address below and let me know that you have acknowledged that you have won and you can email me your mailing address so that I can send that and ship that off to you as soon as possible and uh, yeah I believe that's all that I need to say I'm not affiliated and conditions of like entry you must be an adult so I was graciously given the opportunity to copy Summers from Summer's Tips and Stitches, her rules that she got from Creative Grandma, and I am post posting the, pasting them into this uh, description box below. So I've tweaked it a little bit so that it works for uh, my giveaway, and uh, if you could just say in your comment as well that you have read and understood the rules, that would be great. So thank you, thank you, thank you for that. The other thing that I wanted to suggest was because I'm kind of like uh, love treasure hunts and I love kind of like uh, doing running off on paper trails of different things I'm gonna add a little bit of a bonus here so everything that I've told you is great for the yarn giveaway that I have already showcased but should you want something else which is a very heartfelt thing that I love a hobby that I love doing is some customized made coasters that I personally threw on the wheel so they're made from uh, from pottery from ceramic and I put the stoppers on them already and they come in this wonderful blue glaze like an ultramarine marine glaze you may have to hand wash these because the stoppers are just on tacked on with glue and putting them in a dishwasher they might fall off so if you're interested in getting those coasters as a bonus. Here's what I want you to do. Excuse me. I would like you to go and visit my video 27 where I go shopping in Michael's store and name the pattern that I go to and take off to take home with me because it's a free pattern. Name what the pattern title is and leave that in your comment as well so your comment it's not necessary for you to have this in there it's just for the addition of the two coasters that i will include and if the pattern name is in there when i you choose the random comment picker you will get these as well as the yarn so good luck everyone i wish you all the best with this gift giveaway and it's just my way of saying thank you for watching and subscribing and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye for now.